I mean, some might say it's not that scary of a game. I sure was scared of it when I was younger. But anyways, we're gonna be playing Star Wars <laughs> The Shadows of the Empire. Shadows of the Empire on the Nintendo 64. And it's a game that scared me when I was younger. I definitely had its moments. Sure, it was just because I didn't know how to handle certain games. I'm, I've gotten better now. I've gotten better. But it's definitely one that stuck in my memory. It's a hold, it holds a place in my brain somewhere. What made it scary was that, well, I don't know. I just felt like I, I didn't like dying in games, right? And especially if it's in, th it's in third person. So you can imagine my brain going from 2D to 3D back then. And it was scary. A lot, of, a lot of games scared me. It was around the time where I frequently actually get nightmares from the games I played. And it was, they, they weren't scary games, per se. They weren't games where they were, the intent was to scare you. But this game, Star Wars Shadows of the Empire, it wasn't like that. But let's get to it. We're trying to speed run through these levels because this thing happens in these levels that scared me. So we're trying to get to the good juicy bits. And then I'm supposed to jump over. <laughs> it's an extra life. That's good. Yeah, look, we would have died. We would have been smooshed. Oh, this is scary. That's scary. Our jump while it's turning, too. Oh, okay, so I've taken care of the auto brake. Prepare for impact. Hello? What's happening? Hello? Oh. What's happening? I died! I died! Wait, do I fight him? He shouldn't be able to hit me from there! He shouldn't! He's hacking! I'm fucking dead! Oh my god! No, he's dead. Yes, 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 and that fucking takes so long. Oh my god. Boom. I remember I used to be scared of them so bad, like. We take it on the chin here. We take it on the chin. You know, that's not gonna let us stop us from achieving what we're here to do. See, I could have gotten health. R2D2! Killed him. Killed the little man. Oh. I went to the tower. What's up, bro? You didn't expect to see me come up? <laughs> I'm on the come up, if you didn't know. As I cross the canyon, you'll need a jetpack to reach him. Nice jetpack time. Stupid, it's not taking any unnecessary damage. Fuck! Fuck! 
fuck. <laughs> I was trying so hard. Oh, now I have zero lives. Whoa. Oh, no, 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 no. That's enough for today. It's a new day. Um, I just had to take a break because, ooh, if you remember from last time, it didn't end so well. But yeah, anyways, after that, um, we're back, and we're just coming from the tunnel where we just where we died. And uh, unfortunately, though, he used up all my lives, and I'm pretty much almost dead. I don't, I don't think I have any more lives after this, so I gotta make a count and not die. That's gonna be fun. And it just um it's all hit scan. No. 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 I'm not gonna make it. Oh, maybe. I'm not gonna make it. I just got back. <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done for the day. It's, uh, third day now. Um, yeah, last time didn't go so well. Had to take a break. Had to take a break for another day. This game holds a place in my heart, <laughs> but I can't stand it. Um, I couldn't stand it back then. I couldn't stand it now. And we are great news. Great news. We got past through all the boring levels and we've gone to the level that I've been dying to play. That being the sewer level. Now, this level lives in infamy in my memories of my younger days as a little boy. And you know, coming back to it, it's been it's been a trip. You know, just getting shot up by little mosquitoes. Robots, I don't know what they are. Uh, and fun fact, no, I'm not gonna do that. A fun fact about this level is that on the Nintendo 64, when I played it originally, it was darker than this. I don't know how if it, the dark portions of this level will be as dark as I remember them because I remember them being dark, dark, like I couldn't see anything for miles. Hello? Thank you. And here we go. This is one part of the level that I hated the most. And it's these enemies. Right here, these fucking squid enemies. I always... Mm, I hate them. There's just something about them that I just don't like. like. They live in putrid sewer. They make terrible noises. And they wiggle around. But, you know? I think that's a key. Yep. Yep. Oh, hi. What? Who is you? <sighs> now, because I haven't played this level in such a long time, um, I don't know when the bosses will be coming up. Or if I'm... Never mind, we're here. Hello? Hello? I remember standing. <gasps> no, 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 no. Oh, oh my god. I need air. What? Does this instant kill you? Do they get too close? Do they even touch it once? Ooh, don't touch my penis. Oh, 
What is this? I can't see around me. I can't turn quick enough. I don't know what it wants me to do. Do I shoot the middle? I do. Oh. I'm just gonna die. Look at this! Look at this! Seekers actually do their job? Please work. Bro, no way. No fucking way. I killed it, right? But anyways, what I was saying, I remember standing at the edge right here when I first got the guts to actually push through when I was little. And just stood right at the edge. And I remember, like, what happened. When the water started to rise and the music kicked in, I just... I ran to the console as fast as my little feet could hit me at the TV and just flicked that switch right off. Didn't think twice. Didn't think twice. It didn't even occur to my mind what I was doing. I just instantly just went, bloop, nope. Dropped the controller instantly. Do I go in its mouth? I don't go in its mouth, right? Watch me die instantly. The kill box is still here. Okay, no. Where do I go now? Is there a hole open or something? Yeah, go through the hole. No way. <sighs> I did it. Fucking did it. I fucking did it. I conquered my childhood nightmare. I did it. I can now successfully say that I beat Star World. I didn't beat it. But I can successfully say that I've beat the one game that gave me nightmares.